Hey mom, a couple of my friends are going to the movies and they invited me. Do you think I could get a couple dollars so I could go? You know what? You've done all your chores this week and you've been pretty good. Yeah, you can go. Let me go get my wallet. Ooh, mom's in a good mood and she's giving money out. I better get in on this while I can. Maybe I can get that new toy I wanted. <laughs> hey mom, mom, do you think I could get a couple dollars so I can get a new toy? Oh, I'm sorry, Billy, sweetie. I'm giving the last of my money to Tommy so he can go to the movies. Maybe next week. Oh, Cucamelons! This isn't fair! Think, Billy, think! Hey, Mom, you got that money? My friends just pulled up. Yeah, here you go, sweetie. That's it! I got it! Hey, Mom! I can't believe you're letting Tommy go to the movies when he should be punished! What are you talking about, Billy? Why should he be punished? Because he snuck out last night and he didn't get home till 2 in the morning! What? No, I didn't! Oh, really? Thanks, Billy. Tommy, you snuck out last night? Give me the money back and tell your friends to leave. You're grounded. Get up to your room. But mom, I didn't sneak out last night. Yes, you did. Remember you said mom's an idiot and she'll never find out? I never said that. Mom, he's making it up. I said give me the money back and get up to your room. And make it an extra week for calling me an idiot. But mom, he's making the whole thing up. If I have to say it again, you're going to be punished for the next three months. Tommy, get up to your room. Fine, whatever. But this isn't fair. <laughs> so, Mom, now that you got some extra money laying around, want to take me to Target to get that toy? Sure thing, Billy, sweetie. Let me go get my keys. I'll meet you out in the car. I can't believe this. I'm calling Grandma. Hey, Grandma, guess what? Are you kidding me? Don't worry, sweetie. Grandma's on her way. Oh, hell no. Hell yeah. I got a new toy. Got a new toy. I can't wait to play with my new toy. Hey everybody, Grandma's here. Where's Billy at? Oh, there you are, Billy. Ouch! Oh, hey, Mom. What are you doing here? Oh, good. There you are. I was looking for you next. Ouch, Mom. What was that for? That was for believing this little brat over here and punishing Tommy and not letting him go to the movies. Now, I want you to take this toy back to the store right now, and when you get home, you're grounded. Get up to your room. You can't ground me. I'm a grown woman. I'm not a little kid anymore, Mom. Don't backtalk your mother. Ouch! Don't make me say it again. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Come on, Billy. Get your butt in the car. We're taking that toy back. That's why you're not my favorite grandmother. <laughs> yeah, I don't care. You're not my favorite grandbaby. Oh, Tommy. Oh, hi, Grandma. Thanks for coming over. Here you go, sweetie. Here's money for the movies. I'll give you a ride. You can still make it. Thanks, Grandma. You're the best. Bro, I can't believe Grandma got you the new PS5 for your birthday. I know. This is so cool. Oh, he's over near me. Grandma's the best. Hey, what are you guys doing? Are you serious? Tommy, you hooked up the PS5? Why didn't you come tell me? I got next. Yeah, right, Billy. You must be out of your mind. I'm never letting you touch my PS5 with your Dorito fingers. I only do that so I can save some for later. That Dorito dust is delicious. Come on, plus I don't even have that much on my fingers right now. I'll lick it off. Watch. Ew, no. Now you're definitely not touching my controller. Yeah, just look at your iPad. Your screen protector is just a layer of slimy Dorito dust. No, it's not. Come on, guys. Look, my fingers are clean. I got next. Oh, Tommy, you died. Give me the controller. No, I said you're not playing. Now get out of here, Ice Spice. I told you a million times. I've had this haircut first. She copied off of me. Now give me the controller. I'm telling mom. Okay, go and tell mom then, Napoleon Dynamite. I already told you. You're not playing. Now get out of here. Fine. You asked for it. I'm going to go tell her right now. Hold on. Wait, Billy. That's what I thought. You don't want to get in trouble. Now give me the controller. No, I don't care about that. I just wanted to tell you. Don't forget to tell mom about this. Ouch! No! Nice throw, man. Thanks. I've been practicing. Want to play again? Dude, I'm down to play all night. Hey, Tommy, listen. You're going to share the game with your brother, and you're going to let him play. And you're lucky it's your birthday, so I'm not going to ground you for throwing a sandal at him or calling him Ice Spice. Mom, but it's mine. I don't want him touching it. He'll break it. I'm not going to say it again. You're sharing your game system with your brother, and you're going to let him play the next game. And I'm going to stand here and watch and wait to make sure he does play the next game. Are you kidding me? Fine, whatever. I told you I would play. I got next. I got next.
Michael, start building a sky base. We need to buy time. I'm going to text grandma. Okay, I got you. All right, I sent a text. Hopefully she sees it in time. We need to make this game last as long as possible. Oh, I got a text from my grandbaby. I wonder if he's playing the new PS5 I got him. <gasps> what? Oh, hell no. Don't worry, sweetie. Grandma's on her way. Grandma texted me back. She's coming over. Hopefully no one sees us up here. A few minutes later. Oh man, there's only one team left and the storm is too small. We're gonna have to jump down and fight it out. Okay, let's get this W. Hopefully grandma makes it in time. Oh wow, you boys won. Good job. Now Tommy, give the controller to your brother. I guess she's not gonna make it. If he wants it, he can come get it. Yes, it's my turn. Hey, step away from that controller. Ow! Mom, what was that for? Ow! That's Tommy's PlayStation, and he doesn't have to share with anybody. You understand? Okay! Thanks, Grandma! <laughs> yes, today's finally my birthday! Oh, yes, a new episode of Peacemaker came out, and I got time to watch it before school. Hey, Tommy, what are you doing? I want to watch cartoons before school! Well, that's too bad, because I woke up first, and I'm watching TV. But it's my birthday, and I get to do whatever I want on my birthday! Mom! There's my birthday, boy. Happy birthday. What's the matter, sweetie? Tommy won't let me watch cartoons, and it's my birthday! <laughs> oh, it's okay, sweetie. Don't worry, I'll handle it. Tommy, be a good big brother and let your brother watch cartoons on his birthday. Mom, are you kidding me? But he can watch it on his iPad. Fine, whatever, here. Ouch! Mommy threw the remote at me! <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you, don't throw remotes at your brother's head? You're grounded for a week. And make sure you get right home after school, because we're having cake and opening presents for your brother. Well, then I guess you might as well ground me for two weeks, Mom. Hey, Billy, happy birthday today. Ow! <laughs> Good morning, Mom. What's for breakfast? I didn't make you breakfast this morning. I was too busy making Billy pancakes for his birthday breakfast. Go grab a granola bar and hurry up and go to school. Oh, no. Today's Billy's birthday? I'm just skipping breakfast. A few minutes later. Mom, I'm home from school. I'm ready for cake and presents. Okay, sweetie, come sit at the table. Everybody gather around. We're going to sing happy birthday to Billy now. I better not see anyone trying to blow out the candle and take my birthday wish. Happy birthday to you. Okay, who wants a piece of cake? Ooh, I'll have that piece, Mom. What? No, that's my piece. It has all the icing. Mom, I want that piece of cake. <laughs> I'll give you the next piece. He's the birthday boy. He gets to pick the piece of cake he wants. No, nah, it's okay. Never mind. I don't even want a piece of cake anymore. Good more for me. Many, many minutes later. Mom, hurry up and get my presents. I want to open toys. Okay, here you go. This first one's from your brother. Yes, what did I get? What the heck is this? This is a stupid toy. Ow, it's fine. I'll take it back and you won't get nothing. Good, I'd rather have nothing. Mom, give me my next present! Give me what I get, what I get! Are you kidding me, a poppin'? I already have this poppin'! <laughs> Ouch, good throw, sweetie. I'll have your father take it back and get you something new. Hey, everybody, sorry I'm late. Happy birthday, Billy. Here's your present. It's about time, Grandma. Give me that present. what I get, what I get? Are you kidding me? You got me shoes? What kind of present is that, Grandma? Excuse me, what did you just say? Are you being ungrateful? Ouch! Yeah, I wanted toys, not shoes! Ah. Just because it's your birthday doesn't mean you gotta act like a little brat. You know what? Give your brother them shoes and get up to your room, Billy! But it's my birthday! You can't punish me on my birthday! You wanna try me? Get up to your room! This was the worst birthday ever! <laughs> Thanks for the Uggs, Grandma! I think I see- ah. Ouch! Oh no! I broke my iPad! Oh, you're gonna get in so much trouble, Billy. No, I'm not. Mom will just buy me a new one like she always does. No, she won't. You're not the youngest child anymore, Billy. You're the middle, middle child. That was the one and only iPad you're ever gonna have. She ain't buying you a new one. And you're probably gonna get grounded for like the next three months. Oh, man, are you guys serious? I don't wanna get grounded. And I need Mom to buy me a new iPad so I can play Minecraft. What am I gonna do? She's not going to buy you a new iPad, Billy. You want me to just start knocking your teeth out, and then you can save up all the money you get from the Tooth Fairy to buy a new one? No, I like my teeth. But let's keep that as a plan B, just in case. What can I do? Think, Billy, think. <gasps> I got an idea. Riley! Come here, Riley! Oh, hi, Riley. Come here, I got a present for you. Here, Riley, hold this iPad for a second. How about you throw it around or something, like a football? Hey, Riley, throw me the iPad! Ooh, Riley broke my iPad! 
Billy, you really sunk to a new low. Blaming a baby for something that you did? Hey, I gotta do what I gotta do! Mom! Mom, hurry, come quick! This is never gonna work, Billy. What's going on in here? What's all the commotion about? I was sitting here playing on my iPad, and Riley came up and ripped it out of my hands, and that's when she threw it across the room, and she broke my iPad, Mom! Oh no! Riley, did you break the iPad? Oh, it's okay, sweetie. It was an accident. Yeah, well, an accident ain't gonna buy me a new iPad, Mom. How am I ever gonna play my games? I need a new iPad! Here, give me your iPad, Billy. I'll take it to the store later and I'll buy you a new one. She's just a baby. She didn't mean to. Really? Thanks, Mom! Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm getting away with this. <laughs> I can't believe that just worked. Bro, I think Billy just figured out the golden ticket to get new stuff. You know what? My Nintendo's been acting up recently. I'm gonna give it a try. Here, Riley, you wanna hold my Nintendo? Here you go, Riley. A new ball to throw around. Go ahead, throw it. Mom, Riley broke my Nintendo. I gotta get in on this. I want the new iPhone 14. Here, Riley, you want my phone? You know what, Riley? Maybe you're not so bad. <laughs> hey guys, has anybody seen my Minecraft hoodie? I want to wear it to school. Huh? Riley, what are you doing? That's my sweatshirt. Take my sweatshirt off right now. I want to wear it to school. <laughs> what do you mean, though? Take it off right now or I'm going to tell mom. I want to wear it to school. It's my new sweatshirt. You're never going to get it back, Billy. It's hers now. You might as well just forget about it. No, it's not hers. It's mine. And you want to bet? Watch. I'll get it back. Get over here, Riley. <laughs> hey, get back here. Give me my sweatshirt, Riley. Run, Riley, run. <laughs> I got you. Hey, what is going on in here? Billy, what are you doing? Why are you chasing your little sister? Because she took my Minecraft sweatshirt, Mom. And she won't give it back. And I want to wear it this Tell her to take it off right now! Oh, Riley, sweetie, did you take Billy's sweatshirt so you could wear it? Oh, look how cute she looks in it, Billy. Maybe your sister likes Minecraft like you. You know what? Just let her have it, Billy. Just wear one of your other sweatshirts. I don't want to wear another sweatshirt, Mom. I want to wear my new Minecraft sweatshirt. It's not hers, it's mine. No, I'm sorry, Billy. It's hers now. Look how cute she looks in it. My little Minecraft player. Just wear something else to school. What are you talking about, Mom? She's not your little Minecraft player. I'm your little Minecraft player. She doesn't even know what Minecraft is. Welcome to being the middle, middle child, Billy. Now you know how I feel when you took my Fortnite sweatshirt. We're not talking about this anymore, Billy. Now finish getting ready for school, because if you're late, you're getting grounded. I know what Fortnite was at the time. She doesn't even know what Minecraft is. This isn't over between us, Riley. I'm gonna get my sweatshirt back soon. <laughs> Yo, Michael, what are you doing? Billy got me grounded the other day, so I'm looking up a bunch of bad stuff on his iPad. So when Mom looks at his search history, he gets in trouble too. No way, that's genius. I wanna help. Move over. Yo, check this out. Oh, no way. People actually do that? Here, I got a good one. Let me see it. Did you hear a car door? I think Billy's home. Hurry up. Let's put his iPad back. Hey, what's up, everybody? Michael, what are you doing downstairs? I thought you were supposed to be grounded. I am grounded. Mom took my Nintendo away. What do you think? I'm going to be locked in my room all day? You should be. Now get off of my couch. That's where I sit so I can play my iPad. I said move, Michael. Fine, whatever. Yes, the Ninja Kids have a new YouTube episode out. I'm gonna watch it. All right, Tommy, the trap's all set. Now it's your turn. All right, I got you. Hey, Billy, what are you watching? None of your business. What do you want? Oh my God, he's so annoying. You're about to be watching my fist knock your teeth out. Let me see, Billy. No, stop. Don't you have something better to do? No way. Did I just really see that? Mom, Mom, hurry up. Come quick. What's going on in here? What's all the yelling about? Mom, Billy was just watching something really bad on his iPad. You need to take a look. What? What are you talking about? No, I wasn't. 
Yeah, he was, Mom. I saw it, too. Grab his iPad and take a look. Are you serious? Billy, give me your iPad right now. Fine, whatever. It's not like you're going to find anything on there anyway. Okay, let me see. Now, how do I do this? Oh, that's easy, Mom. You go to his search history. Here, first you click that, and then you click that, and then there it is, right there. Let's see. Cocomelon, Ninja Kids. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, what? Billy, I can't believe you're looking some of this stuff up. Oh, my gosh, was he really looking at that stuff, Mom? What a sicko. Oh, no way. I think you should take him to talk to somebody, Mom. What are you guys talking about? I didn't do anything! What happened to my sweet little innocent baby? As soon as your father gets home, he's gonna have a talk with you, Billy! Oh man, look at that one, Mom! I think I'm gonna be sick. Billy, you are grounded for the next five months! And no more iPad for the rest of your life! Get up to your room right now! That's not fair, Mom! I didn't look up nothing! I was framed! <laughs> have fun being grounded, Billy! <laughs> You know what, Michael? After seeing this, what you did wasn't that bad. You're not grounded anymore. I'll go get you your Nintendo. I can't believe that worked. That was a great idea, Michael. I know, right? But I couldn't have done it without your help. We need to work together more often. Hey, Mom, what are we having for dinner? Oh, we're gonna have meatloaf for dinner. Oh man, are you serious? Okay, Mom. Michael, guess what? We're having meatloaf again for dinner. It's like three days in a row, and Mom's meatloaf is always so dry. I can't eat meatloaf again. I'm gonna go talk to Mom and see if we can have pizza instead. Good luck. Hey, Mom, I was wondering if we could have pizza for dinner tonight. No, we can't have pizza. We're having meatloaf. You boys love my meatloaf. Yeah, but we've had it for like three days in a row, Mom. I think we should change it up and have some pizza today. No, we're having meatloaf. More like dry loaf. Excuse me, what'd you just say? I said, yay, meatloaf. All right, see you, Mom. So, how'd it go? Are we having pizza for dinner? No, and I'm lucky I didn't get a wooden spoon across the back of the head. It looks like we're having meatloaf again. You know what? Let me go ask. Hey, Mom, I just saw on the TV that Domino's is having a special. Buy two pizzas, get one free. Can we have pizza tonight? No, we can't have pizza. And guess what? Your mom's having a special tonight, too. Her special meatloaf. That's what we're eating. Oh man. Sorry, Michael. It didn't work. Looks like we gotta eat it. We're all out of options. La 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 la! Hey, guys! Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm definitely thinking what you're thinking. So, Billy, are you excited about dinner tonight? We're having Mom's stinky dry meatloaf again. Ew! Are you serious? How many times do we have to eat that? We're probably gonna have to eat it for the rest of our lives, Billy. Unless you want to help us. Yeah, how would you like to eat pizza tonight? Pizza? I love pizza! Okay, listen up. I'll give you this dollar if you go ask Mom if we can have pizza for dinner tonight. Whoa! You'll give me a whole dollar just to ask Mom if we can have pizza? Okay, give me it! Ma! Nice touch with giving him a dollar. I really hope this works. It should. Mom can't say no to Billy. Hey, Mom! Hey, Mom! Can we have pizza for dinner tonight, please? But I'm making my meatloaf! You love my meatloaf! Yeah, but I love pizza more. Please, Mom, can we have pizza? Pretty please, pretty please. Oh, my little sweetie. I can't say no to that face. Fine, we can have pizza. I'll order it now. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. My brothers are such suckers. I got a dollar, and I'm having pizza for dinner. Hey, guys, guys. What happened? Are we having pizza or not? Yup, we're having pizza. Mom's ordering it now. Yes. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but good job, Billy. Day, one of my favorite holidays. Baby Cupid comes to visit me, and Mom's always my Valentine. I get so many presents. I'm so excited. <laughs> Whoa! Look at all that stuff. Mom even got my favorite candy. Hey, what are you doing? Get your paws off of that stuff. It's not yours. That's for your sister Riley. Oh, hi, Mom. Happy Valentine's Day. Holy moly! If all that's Riley's stuff, I can't even imagine how much stuff Mom got me. She probably got me a tons of stuff. Oh, yeah, here, Mom. I made this for you, since we're always each other's Valentines. Oh, thanks, but I'm not your Valentine this year, so I didn't get you anything. Riley's my Valentine this year. It's her first Valentine's Day. Now, let's see what you got me. Are you serious right now, Mom? Riley's your Valentine? I bet you she didn't even get you anything. I'm always your Valentine's mom. Yeah, well, not this year. Oh, look, you got me a frame. 
I could put a picture of Riley in this. Thank you, Billy. Really? You're going to put a picture of Riley in there? You know what, Mom? Give me my presents back. Okay, fine. You can have your picture frame back. And a picture of a funny-looking kid in there anyway. That funny-looking kid in there is me, Mom. What happened? I used to be your favorite. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just be quiet. I think your sister's coming down the stairs. Oh, my goodness. There she is. Look how cute Riley looks in her little Valentine outfit. Oh, yeah, Riley. I forgot about you. Well, enjoy it while it lasts, because I'll be Mom's Valentine again soon. <laughs> A few minutes later. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, hey, guys. I shouldn't even ask. Okay, Billy, I'll bite. What's wrong? Why are you so upset? He probably just watched Free Willy again. Billy always cries when he watches Free Willy. That's because it's the best movie ever! Willy should have never made it over those rocks! But no, that's not it! Mom's not my Valentine's this year! Riley is! She didn't even get me anything! It's because you're the middle, middle child now, Billy. You're never gonna get anything again. Welcome to the club. Yeah, that's why me and Michael teamed up. We're each other's Valentine's. Since mom never gets us anything, so we get each other something every year. We call it Brother Times Day. And oh yeah, Tommy, thanks for the new Nintendo game. It's awesome. Ah, uh, you're welcome, no problem. Thanks for the new camera. That sounds so cool! I wish I had a brother to have Brother Times Day with! Billy, you do have brothers. We had a feeling something like this was gonna happen, so we went out and got you something. Happy Brother Times Day! Welcome to the club. No, it's okay. You can keep that. Are you sure? Yeah, we're good. Everybody wake up! It's Christmas morning! Huh? It's Christmas morning! I'm so excited! I can't wait to see what I got! Santa must have brought me so many presents! Move, Riley! I want to see my presents! Whoa! Look at all those presents! They're probably all for me! <laughs> good morning, Mom. Merry Christmas! Hey, Mom. Merry Christmas. I don't even know why I come downstairs. I never get any presents anyway. Merry Christmas, boys. Everybody have a seat. Let's open presents. I'll open mine first. No, you're going to wait your turn. I'm going to hand out the presents. Oh, man. Fine. Whatever. Okay, so the first present is for Riley. Here you go, Riley. Merry Christmas. Got you. Okay, the next present is for you, Tommy. Here you go. Whoa, thanks, Mom. And the next present is for Michael. Here you go, Michael. Merry Christmas. Are you serious? I got a present for Christmas? This is the first present I ever got for Christmas. I think I'm going to cry. <laughs> thanks, Mom. Everybody got their presents. That means I must be next. Mom's probably saving the best one for last. <laughs> Okay, and the next present is for Riley again. Here you go, Riley. Are you kidding me? Riley got two presents? Mom, where's my present at? Shh, be quiet, Billy. You're ruining Riley's Christmas. Look at her open her presents up. Oh, isn't she so cute? What'd you get, Riley? Nobody cares what Riley got, Mom. Where's my presents at? If you're not going to help me, then I'll find them myself. Okay, let's see. This one. Nope, this one's Riley's. Maybe this one's mine. Are you kidding me? This one's for Riley, too? That means this one has to be mine. This can't be real life. Another present for Riley. Billy, get your little Cheeto fingers off of Riley's presents. None of them are yours. They're all for Riley. Are you kidding me? All these are Riley's? But what about me, Mom? Where's my presents at? It doesn't look like you got any presents, Billy. Why don't you go check your stocking? Fine, I'll go check my stocking. But there better be something good in there. Yes, it's heavy. There's definitely a present in there. <laughs> what is it? What is it? What is it? <gasps> are you kidding me? I got that's because you're the middle, middle child now, Billy. You don't get nothing for Christmas. I can't believe I got my first present. I'm never going to open this. I'm going to cherish it for the rest of my life. It's not funny, Riley. This isn't fair. This is bullshit. Oh, man. Look at those presents. They're just...
just sitting there waiting for me to open them. I wonder what they are. Maybe I'll just take a little peek. Billy, you better not touch those presents. They're from Grandma. Yeah, she'll get really mad. Christmas isn't for another couple weeks. She always leaves her presents for us under the tree. But I'm jonesing. I can't take it anymore. I need to know what they are. But I also don't want to get a flip-flop to the head. I gotta come up with a plan. Think, Billy, think. Billy, there's nothing you can do. You gotta wait till Christmas. I can't wait till Christmas. The presents are just sitting there, and they're teasing me. All I hear is, open me. Open me! Think, Billy, think! <gasps> That's it! I got an idea! O'Reilly! Oh, good, Riley! Just the person I want to see. I want to talk to you about something. Billy, what are you doing? I'm working on my plan! Duh! And your plan involves a baby? Exactly! See, if I open the presents, Grandma will get mad and throw a flip-flop at my head. But if Riley opens the presents, she'll just think it's an accident and no one will get in trouble. Really, Billy? You're going to use a baby to do your dirty work? That's a new low. Even for you. You guys are just jealous. You didn't think of it. Now leave me alone. It's time to get my plan in motion. <laughs> okay, so Riley, you see all those presents over there? So all those presents over there? are yours! And you're allowed to open them. Mine. Yup, they're all yours. Go ahead and open them. <laughs> it's actually working. She's gonna open the presents. Come on, Riley, hurry up and open it. Whoa, no way. What is it? Let me see. This is actually my present, Riley. Sorry, I must have made a mistake. <laughs> I can't believe it. Grandma got me the drone that I wanted. This is awesome. It's okay, though, Riley. You still got that big present over there to open. <laughs> Hurry up, Riley. Hurry up. What is it? What is it? No way. Actually, that's my present, too, Riley. I think I made a mistake. Give it to me. I can't believe it. This Spidey and his amazing friends play set. Dude, you are going to get in so much trouble when Grandma finds out. No, I'm not, because I'm not the one that opened them. Riley was. <laughs> Pass it. Nope, I'm sorry. There's no more presents, Riley. I must have made a mistake. These were all mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's okay, Riley. You don't got to cry. I'm sure you'll get presents for Christmas. <laughs> Way to go, Billy. You made a baby cry. You're definitely getting cold for Christmas. Oh, well, Grandma already got me everything I want anyway. <laughs> a few minutes later. Hey, everybody. Grandma's here. I'm home from bingo. Oh, my goodness. What happened? Who opened all my presents? Uh-oh. Grandma got home early. Time to show you guys how a professional does it. It was Riley, Grandma. She opened all my presents and ruined my Christmas. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Riley, is this true? Did you open all the presents? Wait, what? No, I didn't. Yeah, he did, Grandma. Me and Michael saw him. Oh, really? I can't believe that you opened your presents and you tried to blame Riley, Billy. You know what? You're getting cold for Christmas this year. Ouch! And I'm taking all your presents back to the store. This isn't fair. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get, Billy. I know, Mom. I'll do it later. Hello. 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 Michael, what the heck are you doing? I'm practicing my Billy impressions. I think I got it. Why would you ever want to sound like Billy? Take a seat. You'll find out in a minute. Trust me, it'll be worth it. Okay, but this better be good. Hey, what are you guys doing? Oh, nothing. I think we were about to play a board game. Why, you want to play with us? Are you serious? You want me to play with you guys? Of course I'll play! Alright, I'll go get in in a minute. I just gotta ask Mom a question. Hey, Mom, can you come in here real quick? Yeah, what's the matter, Michael? Oh, never mind. I forget. I'm sorry, Mom. Oh, okay. If you need me, I'm going to be in the kitchen making dinner. Yeah! Hurry up and go make us dinner, 
here, you stupid head! Huh? Excuse me? What did you just say, Billy? I didn't say anything, Mom! It was Michael! Nice try, Billy, but I think I know the difference between your voice and Michael's voice. You better not let me hear you say something like that again, or you're gonna get grounded. Shut up, Mom! I'll say whatever I want, you No way. Excuse me? What did you just call me? I think he just called you a female dog, Mom. He must be learning that language from his iPad. Mom, I swear, it wasn't me! Get up to your room right now, Billy. You're grounded. You're lucky I don't wash your mouth out. And I'm going to tell your father as soon as he gets home from work what you called me. But it wasn't me, Mom! This isn't fair! <laughs> I can't believe it worked. Me either. Mom really believed it was Billy. We got to do more. I got an idea. Let's prank call Grandma as Billy. Ooh, one of my grandbabies is calling. Hello? Hi, Grandma! It's me, Billy! I just wanted to tell you that my other grandma is way cooler than you! And she makes better food than you! <laughs> Bye, Grandma! <gasps> How dare you, Billy! You're in big trouble next time I see you! And I'm gonna see you real soon! Oh, hell no! Oh, man! Billy's done for next time Grandma sees him! She's probably on her way over right now! Hey! That wasn't nice! You better tell Mom that wasn't me who said that! What are you doing out of your room, Billy? Aren't you supposed to be grounded? Mom, let me come out of my room to eat lunch! Hey, everybody! Grandma's here! Huh? Oh, hi, Grandma! Where's Billy at? Oh, there you are, Billy! Ouch! What was that for? <laughs> hey, Tommy! I got a question for you! Are you smart? I'm smarter than you. Oh, really? Well, if you're so smart, then spell it! S-M-A-R-T <laughs> I knew you weren't smart! I said spell it! Not spell smart! <laughs> you're stupid! <laughs> no, that was a lame joke. You're stupid. Did you really just call me stupid? That was so mean of you! I'm telling Mom! Mom! Tommy, did you call your brother stupid? Yeah, but only because he called me stupid first. Well, two wrongs don't make a right. You're grounded. Get up to your room right now. Are you kidding me? Is he getting grounded for calling me a name? No, he's not getting grounded. You're older. You should know better. Now get up to your room. That's bull. Guys, guys, guess what? Today's me and mom's movie day, and she's not watching a movie with me. She's watching a movie with Riley. Oh, no, Billy. Are you serious? We better call Channel 6 News. That's not fair. Funny, Tommy, this is serious! Why would Mom do that to me? It's because you're not Mom's favorite anymore, Billy. She replaced you with Riley. I used to have movie nights with Mom until you were born, and then I got replaced. Don't say that, Michael. I'm still Mom's favorite. She could never replace me. I'm one of a kind. Trust us, Billy. You've been replaced. And it's not a big deal. Who cares? Mom talks the whole time during movies anyway. You just gotta deal with it now, Billy. You guys are wrong. You'll see. You're just jealous of Mom's favorite. She could never replace me. Okay. Boys, me and Riley just finished our movie. I'm going to take her to the hair salon. Mom, can I go? I want a haircut. No, you can't go with us, Billy. Look at your hair. It's a tangled mess. You embarrass me. Just go get a brush and brush it. What? But you used to love my hair, Mom. Fine, whatever. Two hours later. Boys, we're home from the salon. Look at Riley's new haircut. <laughs> Are you flipping kidding me? What's the matter, Billy? Don't you like it? Look how cute she looks. No, I don't like it, Mom. That's literally my same exact haircut. What are you talking about, Billy? No, it's not. It's totally different. Oh, no. It's Billy 2.0. <laughs> Billy, I didn't know you had an identical twin. <laughs> hey, Billy, what's your favorite movie? The Replacements? <laughs> Knock it off, you guys! Oh, man, I think they're right. Mom is trying to replace me. Okay, I'm going to go make dinner. You guys play nice with your sister. We told you so, Billy. Welcome to the Middle Middle Child Club. That haircut doesn't even look good on you, Riley. I'm going to be Mom's favorite again soon. You'll see. <laughs> Today, Tommy and Michael skip school. Are you kidding me? Tommy, Michael, get down here right now. Yeah, what's up, Mom? What do we do now? 
Your brother just told me that you two skipped school today. You know what? You're both grounded. Get up to your rooms right now. <laughs> you little snitch. We're going to get you back for this, Billy. Just you wait. Yeah, right. You're not going to be able to do nothing because you guys are going to be locked in your room, punished. <laughs> yeah, and one of these days you're going to get punished too, Billy, and then you'll be locked in the room with us. Yeah, right. I'll never get punished. I'm mom's favorite. Now get up to your room. Three days later. Billy Joseph, did you get markers all over my brand new couch? Uh-oh. I'm sorry, Mom. It was an accident. I didn't mean to. I don't care if it was an accident or not. I told you a hundred times. Don't play with markers on my couch. You know what, Billy? You're punished. What? Are you serious, Mom? But I've never been punished before. Please, I won't do it again. I know you won't do it again because you're going to learn your lesson. Now get up to your room right now. Oh, man. This isn't going to be good. Okay, Mom. This is great. I can't believe Billy actually got punished. Fresh meat walk-in. A few minutes later. Just don't make eye contact, Billy. Don't let them smell the fear. Come on in. You're on the top bunk. But I can't sleep on the top bunk. What if I fall off? Too bad. Wait, what are you guys doing? Why'd you lock the door? Just a little bit of payback time, Billy. Ugh, ugh. This is what you get for snitching on us, Billy. Uh, uh. Ow! Stop, guys! Knock it off! Stop! I'm gonna stop when you say uncle. Okay! Uncle! Uncle! Alright, that's enough, Michael. We don't want to get more time added to our sentence. Boys, it's lunchtime. You're allowed to come out of your room to eat. Come on, Tommy. Let's hurry up and get down there. Okay, boys, here you go. Spaghetti and meatballs, and you each get a Rice Krispie treat. Yes! We're having my favorite meal! And my favorite snack. I love Rice Krispie treats. Hey, Billy, you don't look that hungry. Give me your plate. What are you talking about? I'm starving. I didn't eat breakfast. That's not my problem. Give me your plate or else. Yeah, and I want that Rice Krispie treat. Oh, man. Fine. Here you guys go. <laughs> you made the right move. I'll pocket this and save it for later, Michael. I don't like being grounded. Hey, boys, now that Halloween's over, you know what that means. It's time for our matching Christmas pajamas! Yes! I love when we all get matching Christmas pajamas! That means Christmas is almost here! Oh man, I never get any matching pajamas. Okay, here we go. Tommy, these are yours. Oh, thanks, Mom! And Michael, these are yours. No way, are you serious? You got me matching Christmas pajamas, Mom? Why wouldn't I get you matching pajamas? You're part of the family, aren't you? Thanks, Mom! Oh man, I never got matching Christmas pajamas before. This is the happiest day of my life. I actually feel like part of the family. I think I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna go put them on right now, Mom! And last, here's Riley's Christmas pajamas. Look how cute they are. Mom, aren't you forgetting somebody? What about my pajamas? Oh, I'm sorry about that, Bobby. I totally forgot about you. Just wear the pajamas that you had last year. Who the hell is Bobby? My name is Billy, Mom! Oh man, this is all Riley's fault! Okay, everybody, let's all go get our pajamas on and watch a Christmas movie! I'm down for that. I'll make popcorn after I'm done getting changed. I'm gonna cherish these pajamas forever. This is the best day of my life! <laughs> a few minutes later... Oh my goodness! Look how cute me and Riley look in our matching pajamas! Oh well, I guess I still get to watch a movie. So what movie are we gonna watch, Mom? What are you talking about, what movie we're watching? You're not watching any movie with us, Billy. Pajama club only. You have to have matching pajamas to watch the movie. That's bull, Cocomelon! <laughs> this isn't over between us, Riley. One day, I'll be Mom's favorite, and I'll be the one with the matching pajamas, not you! <laughs> Billy, what are you doing? I'm writing my Christmas list so I can send it to Santa. I don't suppose you're writing one this year since you're probably getting cold again. <laughs> The only reason I got cold is because every time I do something, you tell mom on me and get me in trouble. That's not my fault. It doesn't matter if I tell mom or not. Santa knows when you've been sleeping, and he knows when you're awake. And he knows if you've been good or not, so be good for goodness sakes. Yeah, whatever, Billy. A few minutes later. Yes, I'm all done. Now all I have to do is mail it to Santa. <laughs> and there we go. Mom, I'm all done. I just mailed my letter to Santa. I'm going to go watch Cocomelon now. 
perfect. Time for payback. I'll be taking that. Yo, Tommy, I'm bored. What are you doing? Just getting a little bit of payback on Billy. I took his Christmas list out of the mailbox. No way, are you serious? That's awesome. He's the reason I got coal last year. Move over, I'm helping you out. We're gonna make sure Billy has the worst Christmas ever. Ooh, I got a good one. Write this down. A few minutes later. Okay, Michael, I think we're all done. Let's go put this in the mailbox and wait for Christmas. <laughs> the next day. Everybody, everybody wake up! It's Christmas morning! Holy moly, look at all those presents! Those are all yours, Billy, sweetie. Tommy, Michael, your presents are in your stockings. Oh, well, shocker. I got coal again. There's no way I got coal this year. I was pretty good. Are you kidding me? That's the second year in a row you boys got coal. You should start behaving and be good like your brother Billy over there. Billy, sweetie, you were such a little angel this year. I bet you Santa got you everything on your list. Yeah, Billy, open your presents up. I guess you guys better get comfortable then, because I got a lot of presents to open up. What is this? A Barbie? I didn't want this. Oh, it must have been an accident, Billy, sweetie. Open another one. Yeah, maybe Santa dropped it off at the wrong house. Are you kidding me? Another princess? Mom, I think Santa gave me somebody else's toys. No, he didn't, sweetie. I called Santa. He said that he got you everything on your list. Well, if that's true, then this has to be the new Coca Melon doll I wanted. A sewing machine? Who am I? Sweetie, you don't like it? No, I don't like it! And look, he got me a Trinity and Madison! I don't even watch Trinity and Madison! <laughs> we switched your list, Billy! This is the worst Christmas ever! Hey, Mom, I did all my chores. Can I get my allowance now? What chores did you do? I took the trash out. Okay, what else? I cleaned all the dishes. Nice. Okay, anything else? And I vacuumed the whole house. Okay, here you go. Here's your allowance. Thanks, Mom. Wait a second. Three dollars? Are you kidding me? Yeah, it's a dollar per chore you do. If you don't like it, then give me my money back. No, no, it's fine. I'll keep it. Man. This stinks. Hey, Mom. All my chores are done. Time to pay up my allowance. We'll see about that. What chores did you do? I scrubbed all the toilets. Aw, oh, man. This is so gross. Okay. What else? Oh. And I picked up all the dog poop out back. Is that all? No. And I did everybody's laundry. And you might want to think about putting Billy back in diapers. His underwear look like a chocolate factory. Okay, here's your allowance. <laughs> yeah, boy. But I got a little bit of bad news. You use $15 in cleaning supplies. So I'll keep your $3 and you owe me 12 What? Are you kidding me? That's not fair. Oh, so I guess you'd rather be grounded then, huh? No, I don't want to be grounded. Fine, here. Take your $12. Thanks, Michael. I'll see you next week for your chore update. Man, this is bullsh. Oh, Mom! It's allowance day. Hurry up and give me my money. I want to buy some Robux. Not so fast. First, you gotta tell me about your chores. Give me all the tea. Okay, so first, I was snooping around Michael's backpack, and he got an F on his math test. Are you serious? That boy is gonna be grounded for the next week. Here you go. What other chores did you do, sweetie? Sweet! Oh, well last night, Tommy snuck out of the house. You can check it on the Ring app. Oh, really? It sounds like I'm gonna have to have a talk with him, too. Here you go. What else you got for Mama? Michael took $10 out of your purse earlier. I guess that boy wants to be grounded for the rest of his life. Here you go. What else? Michael got detention in school this week. And two days ago, Tommy skipped school completely. 
And then they borrowed your car without asking so they could go to Panda Express. And Michael broke your favorite lamp. And then he blamed it on the dog. And Tommy failed his history test. Well, good work, Billy. You sure did do a lot of chores. Here you go. Whoa. Sweet. Thanks, Mom. I'm going to go buy Robux. <laughs> okay, have fun, sweetie. I'm going to go have a talk with your brothers.